Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and this is GameStop Dumpster Diving. Now, I've been having some really bad luck with GameStop Dumpster Diving. Not yesterday. Yesterday was actually really, really good. I went to a different GameStop Dumpster and found a lot of good stuff that wasn't broken. But the two days before yesterday, I found all broken stuff. Broken Xbox One games, broken Xbox Connect, broken just everything. Wii controllers, accessories, everything you can imagine. Tons of games. Probably over about like 20 games were broken. So, with that being said I went back to this GameStop that breaks everything now and I wanted to see if the stuff's still broken now with that being said I'm hoping it's not fingers crossed everybody hoping the stuff in these bags if there is anything at all hoping it's not broken now there is a box tonight which I found which isn't ripped up or anything so that's a good sign uh, it's a recon 60p Turtle Beach headset box, and there's nothing in it because it's really, really light. I just wanted to show you guys that I found a box tonight, which, yeah, well, that's kind of cool. If anyone owns this headset, write it down in the comments below. Tell me how it is. But uh, with that being said, probably not going to keep it. Just took it to show you guys. Also, one thing I want to say before we get into these three bags. Yeah, there were three because I ended up not going to this GameStop last night, so there was an extra bag, I guess. And, uh, yeah, so there's three bags tonight. Three times the odds for either good stuff or brr, 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 bad stuff. But before we get into it, if you guys want to go check out my gaming channel, it's called The Speedy Gamer. I'm hoping to shoot for the beginning of next month to actually upload a video. And it's really, like, I don't know, the videos I'm editing right now, I currently am in the process of making them. They are so funny. I think they're hilarious and they're just a lot of fun to make and they're different from videos I've ever made before on my gaming channel so make sure you guys check out the speedy gamer link down below and let's get into GameStop dumpster diving I say we get into the heaviest bag first which is going to be that one that's definitely the heaviest and then we'll make our way down the line now let's get into it oh I'm excited Come on, please, please be good stuff. I'm just, ah, I'm hoping there's at least something that's not broken. Ooh, what is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, is that a sleeve? This is like literally off of a case. Okay, well, this is not good. That's broken. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> I don't know if my heart can take it anymore, guys. If this is stuff is actually broken, I'm going to cry if there's actually anything in here at all. Ooh, I'm seeing something. I'm seeing a wee case as well. What is this? Ooh, ooh, there's a case, or not a case, but there's a CD in here. I can feel it. You can even see it. This is a CDR Memorex. It's like a CD-ROM. It's definitely in there. I can feel it. Is it broken or cut? That is the question. So far, it looks pretty good. Come on, please don't be broken. Please don't be broken. It doesn't look like it's cut. It doesn't look like it's cut. <gasps> yes, it doesn't look like it's cut, but I have no idea what this is actually to. I think it's just a blank CD. Uh, okay, good sign. Very good sign so far. CDR, memory CD. I don't even know if there's anything on it. So far, it's looking good because this wasn't broken. So far, so good. Oh, come on, fingers crossed, everybody. Really, this is like a dire moment. We got a Wii case. We have a Wii case, ladies and gents. Doesn't look like it's actually broken. Okay, it looks like it's actually in good condition. Super Mario Galaxy 2 for the Wii. Let's get it. Come on, please. Oh, okay, it's not in there. But is the case okay? Okay, the case doesn't look like it's broken. It actually looks like a decent case. Now, if you guys were familiar with the, like, the other videos I made about everything that was destroyed, even the cases were destroyed. Now, this one actually looks good. Oh, I, oh maybe it's just a lucky bag. Maybe stuff. In, if there's anything in these, maybe they're broken. But I, I don't know. So far, so good. See, here we go, we got a broken case. Like I was saying, broken stuff. Yep, this is definitely a broken case for sure. You can tell it's all broken. Okay, it looks like some stuff isn't broken though, so that's looking very, very good. Oh, I'm kinda excited. Ooh, what do we have here? Rage for the PS3. Case looks decent, doesn't look too bad. Come on, game. Oh, no, it's another empty one. No. The case looks good though. It actually is a good case. Oh, I'm so excited. You guys don't even know. This is like a relief so far that the stuff in this bag, half of it's broken, half of it's not. So at least the CD is not broken. That is a very good sign. See, we have here, we have some sleeves and manuals. Wow, a lot of sleeves. We have NASCAR. I'm going to keep the real ones and not these ones because these ones are the fake, like printer papered ones. Oh, no, this thing's broken or ripped, I should say, not broken or cut, actually. That looks like a manual for this game. No, that's the manual. Okay, so sadly that is, that's good though. Let's see, these are all fake. We have Starhawk for the PS3. That looks pretty good, I'll keep that. 
That one's fake, 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 fake. And there's even DMC Devil, well, Devil May Cry. Uh, it looks like it definitely got some uh, moisture damage in there somehow. That I'm not keeping, it's flaking in my hands. That's just destroyed from natural stuff. But uh, with that being said, let's see what else is in here. Come on, baby, let's get another game. Let's get something, well, that's not a game, I don't think, but let's get something, let's get all game. There's no games yet. No games at all, just paper, tons of paper in this one. This is cool, it says Marvel on it. I'm not too sure what would have been on this, to be honest. It has little like taggy things on it. That's kind of neat, I'll actually keep that. Because it says Marvel on it, and it has a little hanger. That's kind of cool, actually. Let's see what else we have in here. Oh, this bag was not disappointing at all. I'm actually really excited to see what's in these bags, if there's anything actually at all. But uh, this was definitely a good stepping stone so far to seeing if stuff is broken again. Ooh, that's like all nasty. Um... Oh yeah, all these gift cards are like really gross. I'm not gonna keep those. I usually keep gift cards now. Oh, that one's actually decent. I'll keep that. Because uh, I will be making videos in the future to see if there's actually money on them. Which I have made a video before seeing if there's money on them. Check it out up here. But uh, that looks like that is it for bag number one. Let's get into bag number two and hope for the best. You can see all the little flakes off of that sleeve from Devil May Cry. But uh, let's get into it. Come on, like I'm super pumped up right now. Like I'm really, really pumped up. Come on, something good, something good. Come on, baby. Ooh, what are these? There's two of them. Is that a poster? Ooh, I think these are posters. Yes, these are definitely posters. Yes, drag them. <gasps> what? So there we go. I propped it up a little bit. That is the poster. That is freaking sick. That is a really cool poster. Oh, I love it. And it's not, it's not double-sided, but it is really, really cool. Oh, the colors are really, like, vibrant on that. Nice. Oh, I like that for sure. That is a cool one, and it doesn't seem ripped or anything. Let's go on to poster number two. I think this one's a poster. Is it? It is another drag. Yes! Another poster. Here's poster number two. I'm trying to get it without all the glare so you guys can really see it. That is so sick. Oh, these are so cool. These are nice posters. That one's not double-sided either, but still two posters. Yes, doing good tonight. No games in those. Oh, I'm so happy nothing's broken so far. At least nothing worth keeping that could be broken. Is that a Wii stand? Is it? It's a Wii stand and it's not broken. Yes, <laughs> a Wii stand. I find so many of these. And it actually has the plastic, uh, like clear kind of uh, base. Those are actually harder to find than the actual stand itself. So it's like a stand within a stand. So pretty cool. I'm definitely keeping that for sure. Let's see what else is in here. Looks like weekly ads. Don't really care about that. Come on, anything else? I think that's it for bag number two, guys. I'm gonna throw all this garbage back into this bag, move it to the side, push it all back. Let's get it, and let's see what's in bag number three. Now, bag number three was actually the lightest bag, but you never know. So let's get into it. Also, it's double knotted. I didn't even see that. Okay. Usually when I do find these bags, by the way, like in dumpsters and whatnot, I usually check them out. Like I do a 360 spin. I guess I didn't do it with this one. I usually like to see if I can see anything on the outsides that like gets me pumped up because when I make the video, I love being pumped up and kind of seeing like, I'm just like super like thrilled and excited to see what's in these bags and kind of knowing what's on the sides of them kind of gives you like that, like extra, like, like I don't know, like, extra adrenaline rush. Like I want to get in that bag. <laughs> if anyone dumpster dives, you know what I mean. But uh, also if you don't dumpster dive, you still might know what I mean. Let's get into it. Rip into the bag. It's hard to open because it's double knotted. There we go. That's a little easier. Let's see what is up. Oh, I think I see a PS3 case, maybe? Is it? It's definitely a case. And that is definitely PS3. It is. It's a clear case. <gasps> PS3 case. Let's get it. We have Warhawk. Oh, that's Starhawk. I was like, didn't I just find a Warhawk? Starhawk, and this one's Warhawk. For the PS3, it's in there, it's in there. Is it broken? Is it broken? Come on, okay, it looks good. It looks good on top. Let's check it out. Check out the back of it. Oh, nice! That has like mint condition. Oh, no, 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 it has scratching on the top. But that's not bad at all. Nice! Yes, let's get it. That's freaking awesome. Oh, that is so nice. Yes, let's get it. Oh, I'm so happy right now. We have the first game of tonight that's not broken. Yes. Oh, that is such a relief. Nice. 
So far we have two CDs. We have a game and I think just an empty disc of whatever. I think it's just an empty disc that you can like burn like stuff on like music or something. But uh, let's see what else we have. We obviously have a rubber band, rubber band squad. Let's see what else we have. We have some Xbox 360 sleeves, which are just all printer paper ones. Nothing really interesting, okay. A PS4 little tag. Been finding these a lot lately. I think they're off of clothes, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, not too sure. Too sure. A lot of paper in this one. Wow. Uh, we have some more rubber bands. Bunch of gift cards. I'll take all these. Gift cards. And I'm not seeing anything else in here that's kind of big. I love going to the bottom of the bag because you never know what you're going to find. That's really tiny. But, uh... I think that's gonna be it tonight, guys. And I am just, I'm so happy. It's not a lot. Actually, it is kind of a lot. Just super, super happy that all of this stuff is actually in decent condition. We have Starhawk PS3 sleeve. We have a Rage PS3 case. Sadly, no Rage in there. I love this game, by the way. But sadly, the game's not in there. A bunch of gift cards, like about, there's four, five, six, six gift cards. There's a PS3 sleeve for NASCAR. There's Warhawk, the only game that was found tonight. And it looked like it was actually in decent condition, which I am super happy about. That is really nice. A bunch of rubber bands as well. We have the other disc, which is a Memorex CDR, which is just CD-ROM, and uh, it's just an empty disc. I don't think anything's actually on it because uh, it was in this case. And usually if people do put things on CDs, they usually label them. At least that's what I've noticed, dumpster diving, and uh, just through knowledge. And also over here, a Wii Super Mario Galaxy 2 case, which is pretty dope. I don't think I've ever found that case before. There's two posters for Dragon Ball, and there's also a Marvel hanger for something. If anyone knows what this goes to, let me know. I'm really not sure, but uh, you can hang like lanyards off the side. You can do anything. Maybe a shirt. I'm not sure. And also, the legendary Wii Stand. <laughs> I have over hundreds of these that I've actually found, which that's why I call them legendary. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed tonight's video, which I really hope you did, because nothing was broken. Well, actually, there were a couple cases that were broken, but they're, they were like dummy cases, so who cares? But uh, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I truly love making these videos. I'm just hoping that the past couple days were just really freak things, that they were really odd and strange. It does happen every so often that I do find broken items. Now, maybe someone traded all that stuff in broken and thought it would be funny to trade it in broken. I don't know. I really have no idea. But if you guys did enjoy, make sure you smack that like button. Let me know what was your favorite find in tonight's video. I'll be leaving the last video over here. Most recommended over here. Subscribe to the Speedy Gamer and the Speedy Diver. Make sure you guys definitely check out my Speedy Gamer channel. Going to be uploading super soon, and I'm currently in the process of editing the videos and they are so funny i keep watching them over and over because they're just hilarious but uh thank you guys so much for watching again and i'll catch you guys on the flip side